What the hell was that I just saw? Gwyneth Paltrow. I <laughs> really don't like her. Oh my god, you can't, you can't. Oh! What? What's going on here? I didn't see that coming. This is Fight Club and I already know what it's about because it's going to be a club full of men that want to fight and that's it. That's all the movie's about. It's also got Brad Pitt in it and the last time we saw him was that movie what the hell was it called? Morgan Freeman was in it and there was a head in a box. I can't remember what it was called, but you know what movie. Actually, I think that movie was the first movie I seen with Brad Pitt in it, so this will be the second. It's maybe just him. Maybe he's in a club all by himself. <laughs> it's like someone come and fight me and everyone's like we don't want to fight you and he's like but this is the fight club anyway that's what i'm going with if you like this video please give it a great big thumbs up if you're planning to stay in then please subscribe also check out patreon and comment and all that good stuff that helps the channel grow and i think we're just going to watch because um well i know what it's about already so i, I know what to expect and fight club and play <laughs> This is some crazy music. What am I looking at? Is this an alien movie? Three minutes. This is it. Oh. Ground zero. Were we just inside his head? It's got something to do with a girl named Marla Singer. Marla. Bob. Bob had bitch tits. <laughs> we're still men. Yes, we're men. Aw, Bob. No, wait, back up. Let me start earlier. For six months, I couldn't sleep. This is not what I thought it was gonna be. <laughs> I'd flip through catalogs and wonder, what kind of dining set defines me as a person? I like all of that. <laughs> I love Ikea. I was holding. We used to read pornography. Been there. Now it was the Horchow collection. Not the pornography thing, the hold thing, but also probably por pornography thing. <laughs> You want to see pain? See the guys with testicular cancer. That's pain. Oh, so he... What did I just see flash up there? Like a whole person flashed there. I thought he had testicular cancer, but he does not. So he just can't sleep. I've never had that problem. I'm a very good sleeper. Good example. We really open ourselves up. Did you find it? I keep seeing men pop up. What the hell is that? What am I seeing? You can cry. Just cry. Doesn't have to be about that. Just cry about anything. It's good for you. Something happened. <laughs> oh, he I let go. He's crying. I told you. Babies don't sleep this well. Oh, so he did get a good sleep. I became addicted. To to that meeting. To crying. If I didn't say anything, people always assume the worst. Oh, I see. I see. And she ruined everything. This is cancer, right? No, you're kind. I had seen her at Free and Clear, my blood parasites group Thursdays, then at Hope. Well, she's there for the same reason as you then. I couldn't cry. So once again, I couldn't sleep. Uh, I want to know what she's doing there. Go follow her. Next group. I saw something again. What am I seeing? Is that meant to be there? Or is it? Is it me? Testicular cancer should be no contest. Technically, I have more of a right to be there than you. I still have your balls. Haha, <laughs> that's true. That is really true. <laughs> Looks like this is goodbye. Well, let's not make a big thing out of it, okay? It won't be a goodbye. Where the hell is this fight club? I really wanted to see a fight club. I prayed for a crash or a mid-air collision. Insurance pays off triple if you die on a business trip. Worst nightmare. I feel you would be unable or unwilling to perform the duties listed on the safety card. There he is. An exit door procedure at 30,000 feet. Illusion of safety. That was really scary. My heart's beating really fast now. What do you do? What do you mean? What do you do for a living? Why? Do people actually ask that? Because... I don't think we ask that here. Nobody's ever asked me, like as a stranger, what, what I do. Soap. Sorry. I make and I sell soap. Well, that's a good one. Is it natural soap? My suitcase is vibrating. Nine times out of ten, it's an electric razor. Toothbrush. Or something else. It's a dildo. Yeah. Yeah. Of course it's company. Took the words right out of my mouth. Furniture and personal effects blows out of your floor to ceiling windows and sails flaming into the night. What? Is this real? Is this real what you're seeing right now? 
Well, it, it's your house. What? How did that happen? Police would later tell me that the pilot light might have gone out, letting out just a little bit of gas. Could have killed you, and it didn't. Yeah. I can hear you, but I like how they did that. It was pretty cool. A woman could cut off your penis while you're sleeping and toss it out the window of a moving car. There's always that. Is that something you guys think about? A wardrobe that was getting very respectable to being complete. Shit, man, now it's all gone. But that's what insurance is for. Did lose a lot of versatile solutions for modern living. Fuck, you're right. Everything happens for a reason. My, my insurance is probably gonna cover it. The things you own end up owning you. The things you own end up owning you. Hmm. Call me because you need a place to stay. Oh, hey, hey no, no, no. Yes, you I, did. I mean, cut the foreplay and just ask. Cut the foreplay. <laughs> Can I stay at your place? Yeah. Oh, thanks. He's brave. This whole thing could be a setup. Let me tell you a little bit about Tyler Durden. Tyler was a night person, while the rest of us were. What the hell was that I just saw? If you look for it, you can see these little dots come into the upper right hand corner of the screen. Ooh. Movie keeps right on going, and nobody in the audience has any idea. What? Slicing single frames of pornography in the family film. <laughs> Well, he's been doing it the whole way through this movie, I saw. Is that what I'm seeing? Is that what this is all about? He's done braised on beef and as for the cream of mushroom soup, well, <laughs> you get the idea. Well, yeah, but I, for what reason? I don't know if I would mind because it's Brad Pitt. <laughs> but imagine some random person doing that. That's disgusting. Yuck. And it's so easily done as well. Oh. Mother. Me in the ear. <laughs> I thought he got his collarbone. What? He likes it. Okay, maybe you do want to stay at his house. Boys. Crazy boys. They're just playing, guys. Two mad lads having fun. Hey guys. Hey, let's go. Them two! Them two make the fight club. Yeah, see? Them two. They start the fight club. They invented it. Can I be next? Can I be next? <laughs> I am Jack's medulla oblongata. There's a whole series of these. What? I am Jill's nipple. <laughs> Wait, I want to hear from the nipples. <laughs> I showed this already my man here. You liked it, didn't you? Uh, 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 uh. You can swallow a pint of blood before you get sick. You can swallow a pint of blood? A pint? That's a lot of blood. The second rule of Fight Club is you do not talk about Fight Club. Okay. <laughs> Fourth rule. Only two guys to a fight. One fight at a time, fellas. All right, right. Seventh rule, fights will go on as long as they have to. I think I might like to watch this. If this is your first night at Fight Club. You have to fight. Oh, really? He trounced the major D of a local food court. Wow. For the wet choke when someone Holy crap. Yeah, but what if someone dies? It's between when Fight Club starts and when Fight Club ends. <laughs> if you could fight any celebrity, who would you fight? Huh. Um. Gwyneth Paltrow. I <laughs> really don't like her. <laughs> Bloody hell, you guys are mental. <laughs> Ow! Ow! Tap out, tap out, tap out. Nothing was solved, but nothing mattered. Cool. I don't think you're allowed to do that. <gasps> How about next week? Absolutely not. I would not fight him again. Okay. Any historical figure? I fight Gandhi. Gandhi. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, but you haven't been going to your. How do you, How do you know? know? I cheated. <laughs> Found a new one. Really? It's for men only. Like a testicle thing? 
<laughs> I took what was left of a bottle. This isn't a for real suicide What does that thing. mean? This is probably one of those cry for help. Oh, uh, uh... Let's see if my spirit can use a phone. Have you ever heard a death rattle before? Maybe you should go and see her. Is that nice to you? No. Yeah? No? Did that happen? I don't know what's real and what's not. Been here for two months and Tyler's door was never closed. Uh, what does that mean? You won't believe this dream I had last night. Yeah, I can hardly believe anything you had last night. Oh, it was you. It was you that used the condoms. Where's Tyler? Phone's off the hook. Guess who's on the other end? I already knew the story before he told it to me. Yeah, I know too. Got it. To evacuate, so. <laughs> oh, so it was you. It was you two. <laughs> what's the next? And what's it do? The mattress is all sealed in slippery plastic. No. Uh, that's a humongous one. <laughs> oh. You're gonna have to keep me up all night. Oh. Oh, I wonder how he did that. The shit that came out of this woman's mouth, I ain't never heard. I haven't been fucked like that since grade school. Uh, what? What's grade school? Which one's grade school? I don't think I want to know. I think that's hard enough. What are you doing? You want to finish her off? Oh, you've got rubber gloves on for. <laughs> I want to finish her off. Yes, these are bruises from fighting. Yes, I'm comfortable with that. I am enlightened. He feels powerful. We have some new information about the incident at your former condo. Oh, arson. Freon into your front door lock. Then tapped it with a chisel to shatter the cylinder. Well, who would have done that? Who would go and do such a thing? I'll ask the questions. Tell him. Tell him. Was it you? Did you do that? Did you do it to your own house? Possession, especially the importance of material possession. Yes, I know it's serious. I mean that. I think you did it. Tell him you fucking did it. Tell him you blew it all up. That's what he wants to do. I think he did. But she's trying to hit bottom. What? And I'm not. Chicken feathers up your butt does not make you a chicken. <laughs> Tonight, we make soap. Can you guys please just have a proper wash? To make soap, first we render fat. That's a, such a random thing for you to make when you don't even use it. The salt balance has to be just right, so the best fat for making soap comes from humans. Huh? Wait, what is this place? A liposuction clinic. Oh, oh, yuck, you're making human soap. Richest, creamiest fat in the world. Oh my god. Fat of the land. Oh my god, that's the most disgusting thing I've ever heard in my whole life. Oh god, oh god, oh god, oh god, I can't. Imagine washing yourself with someone else's fat. You have to consider the possibility that God does not like you. In all probability, he hates you. I didn't even think of that. First, you have to know that someday you're gonna die. You don't know how this feels. <laughs> I think he does. It's only after we've lost everything that we're free to do anything. Oh God, oh God, oh God, oh God. Hurry, pour vinegar on it. Did he say water would have made it worse? First rule of Fight Club is you don't talk about Fight Club. <gasps> I'd be very, very careful who you talk to about that. Compliance and liability. My tit's gonna rot off. What? <laughs> Will you excuse me? I need to take this. <laughs> For the police. Quickly. <laughs> I need you to check and see if there's a lump in my breast. Thank you. Wish I could return the favor. I could check your prostate. Yeah. Yeah, you sure could. <laughs> Still remaining men together. I got something so much better now. First rule is I'm not supposed to talk about it. What? I'm a member. Look at my face, Bob. Well, how how do have you not seen each other then? You heard about the guy that invented this thing? He's a great man. Do you know about Tyler Durden? <gasps> I would be so scared fighting him. <laughs> thank you, thank you, thank you. Fight Club. This is 100% a real thing. I just don't know about it because I'm a girl. I see a lot of new faces. Which means a lot of you have been breaking the first two rules of Fight Club. Oh yeah, oh yeah. Because how would you know about it? Well, that's not good. 
Who are you? Who are you? There's a sign on the front that says Lou's Tap. Says what? I'm fucking Lou. Who the f are you? <gasps> How much money's you getting for this? Free to all. Ain't that something? It is actually. Uh oh. Uh oh. You should join our club. You and your friend. I wouldn't want him to. Oh. Really like this place. He's gonna kill him. You can't tell me that you're enjoying that. Ow! He's an actual nutter. Thanks, Lou. You too, big guy. Okay. Everyone be scared of this guy for obvious reasons. You're gonna start a fight with a total stranger and you're gonna lose. This is not as easy as it sounds. Yeah, I wouldn't have thought so. <laughs> Most people, normal people, do don't just about anything fight. to avoid a fight. They don't want to fight. <gasps> You're supposed to lose. This is so flippin' funny. We need to talk. Oh. You're gonna start a fight with your boss, man. He's gonna say you've been beating him up. What the hell are you doing? I don't think that's possible. I don't think you can beat yourself up. I've seen that in a movie before and that's... I don't think you can do it. Why would you do that? But all they need to do is check his hands. Please, no! For some reason I thought of my first fight with Ty. <laughs> this is how Tyler and I were able to have Fight Club every night of the week. What? They needed to check his hands. Involved in a class action lawsuit with the Pressman Hotel over the urine content of their soup. Oh yeah, that makes sense. The urine content. And what about everything else? Tyler dreamed up new homework assignments. He handed them out in sealed envelopes. Why? That's evidence. You need to just tell them. Stop putting things on paper. There's a fight club up in Delaware City. There's one in Penn's Grove, too. I bet there's one, like, in every city. <laughs> the boys are having a bloody good time. These are all very, very good ideas. Human sacrifice. Hey, is that a gun? Covering cars and pi pigeon shit and... Stop doing, doing that. Head right on your back. That's going to the extreme. Mom and Dad are gonna have to call up kind of Dr. So and so. Pick up your dental records, wanna know why. This is taking it too far. What did you wanna be? Did you have to get more schooling? Too much school. Would you rather be dead? Oh, I see what he's doing. I see. If you're not on your way to becoming a veterinarian in six weeks, you will be dead. He's speaking shy, he's not gonna kill you. Run, Force, run! <laughs> I know that! I feel ill. I just watched that. Run, Force, run! Also, maybe he doesn't want to be a vet anymore. What the fuck was the point of that? Tomorrow will be the most beautiful day of Raymond Castle's life. I kind of agree, but it's still, it was it was a bit too far. It was like a timid version of the Saw movies. Like fucking khakis. You were the all singing, all dancing crap of the world. It's very clever. What, what is all this? What do you think? What, he's gonna set up Fight Club in his house? I'm sorry if there's a misunderstanding. End of the world. Do I know him? I think I know him. Because you were trespassing, and I will have to call the police. I think I know him. You're too fat. <laughs> You're too old, fat man. Oh, too old. <laughs> Is that Bob? That's Bob. Oh, he's going. <gasps> he's going. Are on the scene right now. Hold on, please, Commissioner. What did you guys do? <laughs> Holy shit. Yeah. How the hell did you do that? Did you guys do? Sir, the first rule of Project Mayhem is you do not ask questions, sir. Too far. He's gone too far. All your fight clubs are going to get shut down. Whatever you sort of way to do, I think you need to stop and think about it. He's a poor old man. You're gonna call up your rigorous investigation, or these guys are gonna take your balls. Oh my god, you can't, you can't. 
Do not fuck with us. <sighs> okay. <laughs> I am Jack's inflamed sense of rejection. This is uh, like total madness. He's not going to be able to stop. He's not going to stop. I felt like putting a bullet between the eyes of every panda that wouldn't screw to save its species. Take him off, take him off. Ow, the noises. The noises. Oh, it's too much. I felt like destroying something beautiful. Oh, he's okay. He's okay. He's probably lost all his teeth. What you think you know about life, about friendship, and especially about you and me. What? What, what is that supposed to mean? Yeah, I'm as confused as you are. <laughs> hey, that was... Damn it, fuck you. Fuck Fight Club, fuck Marla. I am sick of all your shit. That, I saw that coming. <laughs> Pathetic. Why? Why? What are you talking about? Why do you think I blew up your condo? <gasps> it was him. Let go. All right, fine. I don't like how crazy he is. How did he know his address? I thought for sure it wouldn't. It couldn't have been him because he didn't know where he lived. <laughs> and I don't think there's any need for that. You could have killed everyone in the car. When you look down, you'll see tiny figures pounding corn. I can't deal with this man. The empty carpool leaves some abandoned superhighway. He's all of the crazy. Not one bit missing. And then... Tyler? Tyler was gone. Nah. Was I asleep? <laughs> Had I slept? What? <laughs> I don't think you want to be a part of this. It's under control, sir. Oh dear, your face. Destroy a piece of corporate art, trash a franchise coffee bar. Wow. Holy... That might be the coolest thing ever. They shot Bob. They shot him in the head. In the head? In the head? Oh, <gasps> oh, oh, Bob. Oh, poor Bob. What, what? What's happening? What's happening here? We went to all the cities on Tyler's used ticket stubs. I'm looking for Tyler Durden. I wish I could help you. Tyler had been busy setting up franchises all over the country. Was I asleep? Had I slept? <gasps> Imagine this was all one dream and one night. He finally got a good night's sleep and this was his dream. Do you know me? Is this a test, sir? No, this is not a test. You were in here last Thursday. What the hell happened to you? Who do you think I am? You're Mr. Durden. You're the one who gave me this. What? What? Have we ever had sex? What kind of stupid question is that? This is a trick. Just answer him. We did make love. When? Just answer the question, Marla. What's going on here? The sensitive side? Then you turn into a total asshole. Is that a pretty accurate description of our relationship, Tyler? Well, I don't know. What's happening? Why don't you just call me? Say my name. Tyler Durden. Tyler Durden, you fucking freak. What's going on? Oh my god. He is Tyler. He's, he's both people. What is going on here? I ask you for one thing. Is he both people? Well, answer me, why do people think that I'm you? Cause he is. I think you know. Cause you are you. Got it. No. Do yes. not with us. Say it. You are Tyler. Say it. Wow. Because we're the same person. <gasps> That's right. We are the what? all that's all cracked. I didn't see that coming. The ways you wish you could be, that's me. I feel like you want to fuck on free in all the ways that you are not. People do it every day. They talk to themselves. They see themselves as they'd like to be. Naturally, you're still wrestling with it. Oh, I should have seen this coming. You're just letting yourself become Tyler Durden. 
Jesus Christ. Technically, you're fucking mama. Oh. oh my God. Oh my God, yeah. <laughs> How did I not see this coming? <gasps> Clean food, please. Advise against the lady eating the clam chowder. No clam chowder, thank you. Oh, lovely. What's in the clam chowder? <laughs> <laughs> Is any of this real? I'm, I'm trying to tell you that I'm sorry. What I've come to realize is that I, I really like you, Marla. I saw that. Things about you I like. You're smart, you're funny, you're spectacular in bed. Really? <laughs> you have very serious emotional problems for which you should seek professional help. Yes, definitely professional help. You're the worst thing that ever happened to me. I can see that as well, yeah. I agree. This is ridiculous. I'm so confused. Go to the house, buried in the garden, find the body of Robert Paulson. You're not gonna find- I think you're Bob as well. I think he's Bob too. Keep him talking. I need to make a phone call. You need to make lots of phone calls. And quickly. I really they... admire what you're doing. <laughs> I knew it! <laughs> you're a brave man to believe this. I bloody knew it. Mistake, fellas! You said you'd say that. I'm not Tyler Durden! You told us you'd say that too. What? First person comes out this fucking door gets a gets a lead salad, you understand? Maybe put your trousers back on. <laughs> There's so much going on in my brain right now. This is all happening because he couldn't sleep. I can't I can't tell what's going to happen here. I still think it might all just be a dream. And also that he's Bob. It's also very confusing. Greatest thing you've ever done, man. No, I can't let this happen. You know there are ten other bombs in ten other buildings. Wait, remember at the start when he when he didn't get his luggage because it was vibrating? This is all part of it. I like how it keeps doing that. <laughs> That's funky. Just you control him, he's in your head. Ow. Ow. I gotta have your hair. Oh my god, this, no, this needs to stop now. I don't like it. That's enough of this bit. Thank you. This is it. The beginning. Oh yeah, I forgot about this. I still can't think of anything. Flashback humor. <laughs> it's getting exciting now. Uh -huh. Please explain all. No way. Why is she here? Tying up loose ends. No way. Wait, are you her too? You're her too. Are you just everyone? I will carry you, kicking and screaming, and in the end, you will thank me. Oh, my brain hurts. My brain hurts so bad. <gasps> Why do you want to put a gun to your head? Oh, that won't change anything because I don't think you're the main person. Our head. I don't think you're the main person. My eyes are open. Oh my god, what the actual craziness of everything in this movie is just mad. I don't understand. Fine. Oh. Look, I'm fine. <coughs> Everything's fine. Why did he say his eyes were open? Oh my god, I'm not coping with this. I'm not coping with this movie. Leave her with me. Get your stuff. I'll meet you downstairs. How are you still alive? Someone help. You shot yourself? Yes, but it's okay. I'm really okay. He's still alive because he's not the main person. What? Please, someone explain this movie to me. <laughs> None of this is real, is it? None of it. Don't you dare. Oh my god. Why? Why? Was any of that real? Why would you make a movie like that? Something needs to come up and explain all this. And there is nothing. That may be the craziest, maddest, strangest movie I've ever seen in my whole life. Ever. Let me try and make sense of any of it. Did any of that actually happen? How did he shoot himself and he was still alive? He wasn't the main person. 
Was Bob the main part? Was the girl the main person? Who was the main person? Did everyone that had the scar on their hand were they all him? This is going to bug me for the rest of the day now that I can't even remember what happened at the start of the movie. He said that he couldn't sleep. He said he could never sleep. Was all of that just a dream? I am so, so confused. <laughs> this is the second boy movie that I have watched in a few days and I much preferred this one, I think, but I'm so so confused by it. Someone please make sense of it all. <laughs> I need to watch it again. Was he just everyone in the movie and it was a dream and then the dream ended when everything exploded? I can't, I, can't, I just can't, I can't figure it out and I'm not even going to google it. I'm just going to wait and see the comments because I can't. I can't. <laughs> Is this, is this a boy thing? Do boys understand this movie? And I just can't because I'm not a boy. <laughs> the main actor was a very good actor. Brad Pitt. To start with, I was like, he's just the same as what he was in the, la the other movie that I spoke about at the start. But then towards the end, he... Um, Brad Pitt's always just going to be Brad Pitt, is he? He's always just going to be the, the pretty one. But Bob got shot and his head was hanging off. And they buried a bit, Bob, was he Bob? That is proper, proper messed with my head. Is it meant to make sense? Tell me it's not meant to make sense and then I'll be fine. I like, I really, really liked how they kept doing. Wait a second, before I say that, what was the things that kept popping up at the start? I only saw them at the start. It was like people. And then I kept seeing a penis. I just, I just, I just can't, I just can't. <laughs> What was I always say? I liked how they kept doing like the the shots of but when they were explaining how the uh, house got blown up and it was going behind the fridge and stuff and then they did it again with something else. They did it a few times. I really liked that. That was pretty cool. Did I like the fighting? Yes, I liked the fighting. I did. I actually liked the fighting. Not when it got too much and I think I think I would maybe like to see that but there's a point that it gets it goes too far and then you're like okay that's enough stop that now but before that i think it, it would be all right <laughs> there is fight clubs in the world isn't there i just know there is this is a crazy crazy world and there's definitely fight clubs everywhere every city i probably has got one i just i i just can't make sense of it i just can't anyway that was fight club whoever thought of that has a, an imagination a very strange imagination one that I would never be able to think of. And that is all. That is all I'm saying on that because I can't, I'm, I'm hurting my brain trying to think of what I just watched. And it was long. It was a long movie as well. And there was so much happening. Yeah, I, I'm done. I'm done. That's it. I'm done for today. Right, I suppose this is a good time to ask you to like this video and subscribe if you haven't already. And also comment, Patreon, uh, post notifications, all that good stuff that helps channel grow. You know. It helps me and I love it and I love you for it. And I'm just going to go because I, I'm done. I'm just done. Craziest, weirdest. What is even the word for that movie? I'm just going with it was all a dream. And that's it. And that's, that's the word for it. It was just a dream. And I'm going to go. Thank you so much for watching. I will see you in the next one, which I hope I can understand even the slightest bit compared to this one, which I did not. And, and, um, goodbye. <laughs> Thank you.